We're Taylor, Mike, Ziggy, and Ditto, and welcome back to our Vlogmas series. Today is one of my most favorite days of this series because we headed to Arco Beach for Christmas Eve. Arco Beach is a lesser known beach within the Ojo Chal and Uvita area, and it is actually part of the Marino Baena National Park System. Arco Beach is a little bit tricky to get to. You can enter it through multiple ways since it's part of the Marino Baena National Park System. One of those ways is through Pinuelas. We ended up taking the back way, which is not common for tourists, but it leads to a fun adventure. The turnoff doesn't have any signs, so we just turned right in here. And you'll see signs leading up to Arco Beach, but then you don't see any on this particular road. I do recommend four-wheel drive if you're going to take your car down here. The road conditions have been improved over recent years, but they're not great. You take this road until it ends, and then there's a little space for parking. We took three cars, and there seemed to be space for about two or three more cars without blocking each other in. The beach only exists two hours before and two hours after low tide. Once you park, there's a little trail that leads towards the ocean. You wanna take this mountain trail, which is beautiful, and you'll know you're in the right spot when you see a giant bamboo bunch. The grooves and holes throughout this earth are actually leaf cutter ant homes. If you leave them alone, they'll leave you alone as well. It is like a nice little surprise at the end. It's like... Oh, this isn't even the beach we're going to. Oh, it isn't? No, we, go, we walk this way and go up over a mountain again, and then we're at the beach. <laughs> really? Yeah. <laughs> You might get excited when you see this ocean, but it's not your final stop. You're going to want to take the beach to the right towards these rocks, and then there's another mountain path that you'll take before getting to the beautiful Playa Arco. Good boy. You wore yourself out too early, ditto. Go, ditto. You'll know you're in the right spot when you see the Parque Nacional Marino Ballena Sector Playa Arco sign. After the sign, head right and you'll find a cave, which we'll show you. And just past that cave is this beautiful long stretch of sandy beach with calm waves, making it ideal for if you have children or don't want to surf and just and swim. Bam! Good boy! This is seriously unbelievable. Step. There's also a cave here and it's so cool. You could walk through it the entire thing. Let's do it. If you go when it's high tide, then you can't walk through it, you swim through it. <laughs> It is ocean. Ooh, spooky. Ah! <laughs> we are so focused. This cave and the tide pools that surround it are some of my favorite things about Playa Arco. We will be showing it more in detail in future videos, so stay tuned. <laughs> They got afraid of you guys, huh? They got smart. <laughs> this is an amazing beach. Wow. We're at the very edge, looking at tide pools. Yeah. Best beach, for sure, no questions.
I don't actually have footage of us heading back because we did wait too long and had to go through knee-high ocean water. But we will be doing a more detailed walkthrough of this beach soon. We headed home and got ready for Santa. What is Santa eating? The reindeer is eating. So thoughtful. Yummy! And what's in the cup? Join us tomorrow as we spend Christmas in Ojochal, Costa Rica.